Hey, Mark. You have to entertain people today. But we just only make them better, more attractive, more, more fun to watch. So if you guys want some comedy, just watch me try to get dressed. That's, that was the idea. Action. The lights and cameras are shining in Provo as cast and crew work on what they hope will be the next big box office smash. You know what I'm talking about? Or jumps and snaps. Writers and producers are taking the American classic Moby Dick and putting a fantasy twist to it. Well, it's Moby Dick with dragons. Captain Ahab and Ishmael are in search of dragons instead of whales. The movie stars Vinnie Jones and Danny Glover. And we all know Moby Dick. We all know the moral dilemmas in Moby Dick. And we also know that moral dilemma is centered particularly in its captain. Moral. Glover plays Captain Ahab, whose troubled past has him on an obsessive hunt for the white dragon. You know too well it was that accursed beast. And I will chase him across every mountain and through hell's flames. This isn't Glover's first trip to Utah. About nine years ago, he directed the film Just a Dream, but most remember him from the Lethal Weapon movies. Now the actor is excited to get back in front of the camera for this movie. I think strong acting from, from all of us, you know, and believing in who we are, believing in what we do, and coupled with the special effects as well. Writers and producers wanted the movie to mirror author Herman Melville's vision of a man so determined it drives him to madness. And we actually use their names. It's exactly the, the, the same. And we have a lot of lines that are directly extracted from the, from the book. So it's Moby Dick with way more excitement, way more action. But ultimately, it's moviegoers who will decide if Dragons does indeed make this timeless classic more exciting. And they're going to enjoy it. They're going to they're gonna go on this wonderful roller coaster ride of filmmaking. The movie is scheduled for a release in October. And cut.